Betelgeuse, the galaxy's largest and most stunning star, rested on the shoulder of Orion like a guardian of space. It has been watched by people for millennia in wonder and curiosity. Its vivid red blaze and recent mysterious periods of fading have contributed only to the mystery. As a red supergiant nearing the end of life, Betelgeuse will explode in a brilliant supernova blast. But when this star phenomenon will occur is one of the biggest secrets of astronomy. Some hypotheses suggest that it may occur soon, while others calculate it in thousands of years. Such uncertainty makes Betelgeuse an intriguing mystery for scientists and astronomers alike. Betelgeuse has been making headlines and capturing the hearts of astronomers worldwide since late 2019 due to its sudden and dramatic brightness changes. These changes deviated significantly from its well-established 400-day pulsation cycle, raising new questions regarding its stability. This sudden change prompted a worldwide scientific response, with observatories all over the globe monitoring the star closely. The advent of the James Webb Space Telescope JWST, with its powerful infrared capabilities, has brought a completely new dimension of insight. With its cutting-edge technology, Betelgeuse's outer shell was observed by JWST layers with unprecedented depth, showing evidence of structural instabilities and possible indications of an impending supernova explosion. Should Betelgeuse explode, the supernova would be observable even during the daytime, producing a light equal to that of the full moon. It would be one of the most wondrous natural events ever witnessed. But as stunning as the sounds, many people have wondered would such an explosion endanger our planet or solar system? Betelgeuse lies approximately 650 light years from Earth close enough to study in detail but far enough that we're in no immediate danger. Current models suggest the star may only have around 100 to 300 years of nuclear fuel left in its core. Having exhausted the hydrogen to be burned, Betelgeuse has reached its helium burning stage, converting helium into carbon and oxygen. This is typical of enormous stars approaching the end of their lives. As it burns the heavier elements, the star has swelled to enormous proportions. If Betelgeuse were somehow placed in the center of our solar system, its outer atmosphere would extend past Jupiter's orbit, if not Saturn's. Despite its enormity, measuring Betelgeuse has proven problematic. The star's atmosphere is complicated and turbulent, and its size changes according to the wavelength of light used to measure it. Infrared measurements indicate that it's much bigger than visible light observations suggest, making it a tricky target to define. When Betelgeuse finally runs out of the remaining fuel it has, the fusion process that maintains the star's gargantuan mass will collapse. Without the outward pressure of nuclear fusion, gravity will prevail, and the core will collapse in on itself with unimaginable ferocity. This core collapse could create a neutron star or, more likely, a black hole due to Betelgeuse's mass. During this apocalypse-like process, the outer regions of the star will be violently flung into space at speeds of up to 25,000 meters per second, releasing an astronomical amount of energy. The explosion of this supernova would trigger a stellar light display on a cosmic scale. To Earthlings, Betelgeuse will blaze brightly in the sky, perhaps at full moon brightness for weeks or even days. It will be both scientifically invaluable and a visual treat, giving astronomers a rare opportunity to witness such a close stellar death in real time. One of the most intriguing mysteries about Betelgeuse in recent years has been its unpredictable and bizarre behavior. In late 2019, astronomers observed the star's decreasing brightness, fading more drastically than ever before, leading to popular belief that a supernova was imminent. The fading was more than just a small dip, it was visible to the naked eye, decreasing the star's brightness by more than half. At first, hypotheses ranged from dust clouds to internal pulsations. Further studies demonstrated that Betelgeuse had indeed lost a significant portion of its visible outer layers in a stunning event, possibly a partial surface explosion. This kind of activity had never before been observed in a star like Betelgeuse, adding new sophistication to our understanding of stellar demise. 
Scientists began wondering nervously, was this merely a sensational change in the life of a supermassive star or the first scene of its final curtain call? Stars, especially variable stars such as Betelgeuse, are prone to wink and blink through internal activity. Betelgeuse itself had long exhibited a fairly steady 400-day cycle of brightening and dimming. This rhythm was its hallmark, a kind of divine heartbeat that provided scientists an evolutionary timeline to follow its development. But toward the end of 2019, something totally unexpected happened. Betelgeuse completely broke the trend. Within weeks, it darkened in terms of luminosity, leaving its anticipated behavior behind. This dramatic, abrupt departure was called the Great Dimming. Gone was the predictability astronomers had come to rely on, causing a commotion in observations and theoretical modeling. What could cause such a great star to suddenly and deeply decrease in light? An internal instability. A surface collapse. The scientific community scrambled for answers because if Betelgeuse was straying from its normal patterns, it could indicate that it was significantly closer to exploding than previously thought. Years of observation and speculation came to a head when a French team of astronomers, in conjunction with NASA, combed through data collected from the Hubble Space Telescope and other ground-based telescopes.